Yo. What up, y'all? So today I'm going to show you basically um, the process of silk screening. And at the beginning of the process, we're going to start with our mesh. Uh, if you are being handed down or starting with any used mesh that currently have emulsion on it, you're going to want to remove the emulsion. So uh, any advice for anyone starting off, anyone starting off, go to your local supply store um, and get these three, uh, three liquids that I would recommend. It's going to be one is the emulsion remover. The other one's going to be um, the screen press wash. And then the other one is going to be a dehazer. So that's like a degreaser or dehazer. So if you get those three type of uh, chemicals, you'll be set for the process of doing this in terms of cleaning, okay guys? So here I have my emulsion remover. I've already removed the ink from this, uh, the, uh, of the mesh beforehand. So I only have my emulsion remover in a bottle and I'm gonna basically scrape it down and spray it all down. There you have it folks, now I get to go home, put a, uh, I might have to dehaze it and then I'll go home and put some new, uh, some new emotion on it and then burn it. So stay tuned for that. Yeah. All right. Now, now that you have your emulsion removed, you're gonna wanna dehaze, get the stain off. I mean, I guess it wouldn't really matter because you're throwing new emulsion on there, but it's still kind of see it. Stack them one at a time. <clears throat> so this is what your dehazer looks like, guys. All right, usually you use a spray bottle. I don't have an extra spray bottle right now. Now these are all bio safe. Um, you'll see it on the container, it's bio safe. Everything's just gone.
little bit more and then we'll throw it in there. All right. So now we have just dehazed it. Basically, there's no more design stained on the screen. You can see right here where it used to be. Just a couple of lines. No biggie. Um, so now I'm going to throw some new emotion on there. And then we're going to burn a new frame. So check it out. 